Hello everyone. Welcome back in today's tutorial on Data Warehouse and Informatica Power Center interview question. In today's session, we will see the few of the basic interview question that that is being asked in the interviews. So let's part. Uh, let's start the today's part on this Informatic uh, Informatica Power Center and the Data Warehouse interview question. The very first question is asked is what is data warehouse it's a kind of de definition we should know about the data warehouse definition and the definition is a data warehouse is a subject oriented integrated time variant non-volatile collection of data in support of management's decision making process so if someone asks you the what is data warehouses you should mention it is subject oriented integrated time variant and non volatile collection of data etc so let's see the next question what are the types of data warehouses basically there are <coughs> three types of data warehouses enterprise data warehouse ods that is operational data data store and the data mart what is data mart a data mart is a subset of data warehouse that is designed for a particular line of business such as sales, marketing, or finance. In a in in a dependent data mart, data can be derived from an enterprise wide data data warehouse. In an independent data mart, can be collected directly from sources as well. What is Snowflake schema? A snowflake schema is nothing but one fact table which is connected to a number of dimension tables. The snowflake and the star schema are methods of storing data which are multidimensional in nature. What is star schema? A star schema is the simplest form of data warehouse schema that consists of one or more dimensional and the fact table fact tables so if you compare the snowflake schema and the star schema snowflake st schema contains only one fact table while the star schema can contain multiple facts table what are etl tools etl tools are stand for extraction transformation and loading the data into data warehouse for decision making. ETL refers to methods involved in accessing and manipulating source data and the loading it into target database. What are dimensional table? Dimension tables contain attributes that describe fact records in the fact table. What is data modeling? Data modeling is representing the real world set of data structure or entities and their relationship in their data models. And it is required for a database. Data modeling consists of various types such as conceptual data modeling, logical data modeling, physical data modeling, interface data modeling, and the last one is relation data modeling. Oh, sorry, uh, the second last is relation data modeling and the last one is dimensional data modeling. What is surrogate key? Surrogate key is a substitution for a natural primary key. It is just a unique identifier or number of each row that can be used for the primary key for the table. What is data mining? The data mining is the process of analyzing data from different perspective and summarizing it into useful information. What is operational data store or sometimes interviewer might ask what is ODS? A ODS is an operational data store which comes as a second layer in the data warehouse architecture. It has got the uh, characteristics of both LT, OLTP and DSS system. What is the difference between OLTP and OLAP system? OLTP 
is nothing but online transaction processing which contains a normalized tables but olap that is online analytical programming contains the history of oltp data which is non volatile act as a decision support system that is dss how many types of dimensions are available in the informatica below are the dimensions available in the informatica junk dimension degenerative dimension and confirmed dimension what is difference between er model and dimension model er modeling is used for the normalizing the oltp database design dimension modeling is used for denormalizing the rolap and molap design what is the maplet it is very generic question and it is most of time asked the maplet is a set of transformation that you build in the maplet designer and you can use in multiple mappings what is session and batches session a session is a set of commands that describe the server to move data from the source to the target batch a batch is a set of tasks that may include one or more number of tasks like sessions email command etc so session is set of command while the batch is a set of tasks what are the slowly changing dimensions dimensions that change over the time but unpredictably are called slowly changing dimension it is abbreviated as scd slowly changing dimension type 1 which has only current records slowly changing dimension type 2 which has current record as well as the historical records slowly changing dimension type 3 which has current records plus one previous record so these are the types of dimensions uh what are the two modes of the data movements in the informatica server there are two types of mode which are normal mode and bulk mode in normal mode for every record there is a separate dml statement which will be prepared and executed in a bulk mode in which for a multiple records dml statements will be prepared and executed thus improves the performance what is difference between connected and unconnected transformation connected transformation is a connected to the other transformations or directly to the target table in the mapping unconnected transformation an unconnected transformation is not connected to other transformation in the mapping it is called within another transformation and returns a value to the that transformation so these are the questions about the informatica power center and data warehouse kindly watch this place we will be coming with a part 2 of the interview question on the informatica power center and the data warehouse thank you for watching the video have a nice time and you can subscribe my channel for the further updates thank you